Hey everyone, welcome to The Scratch Show. I'm Matt from Hackingtons.com. And yes, you can submit your projects now to The Scratch Show so I can show them off. I am bringing back the SCC, Scratch Code Club. <laughs> Okay, we have Platformer World by Coder. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, three, four, six, eight, seven. Yes, you have an original username. Now, this game at first was super underwhelming because you're like a blob of water and your goal is to touch the blobs of water. But once you get that, the soundtrack just, oh, yeah, I can do this. I can do this. Okay, hold on. I can do this. It's driving me nuts. There we go. This is an awesome level. At first you're like, how do I do it? Then you just free fall. Yeah, I love it. All right, with the Hawaii theme, we have Ukulele by Eduplational. This game is really cool. It's not really a game, it's just music. I'm getting better at playing the ukulele. Okay, let me check this out. Inside the code, I want to see why you can't just strum it. Look, they actually coded the strumming to start if the mouse pointer touches, but we didn't put a forever loop around this if statement, so it's not firing, it's not triggering the code. So go in the control, wrap that in a forever loop, and now it should start working. There it is. It's not perfect, but it is working. You have to do that for each one of the strings. Cool project, though. I love it. Up next, we have Air Co Combat by Scratch and. What a cool username. Let's make it full screen so we can see this. Okay, let's play the game. We're ready to shoot. What are we shooting? Are the, are those aliens? I like the sounds. Awesome game. Now, there are a lot of geometry dashes on Scratch, but this one by Q57, which looks like it is a remix, is pretty amazing. I love the submission. Let's get playing. Full page, press start. I pressed it. Oh, I like the fade in. Okay, here we go. I like the soundtrack too. Whoa! Great animations. <laughs> Look at that explosion. Okay, we have an adventure game by a student at our Pleasant Hill location named Trace C. And this game, I'm a little space dog getting a pitchfork. Look at that. Level one, really easy. Level two, it has some nice coloration. But check it out when I die. You are a loser? That's pretty insulting. Could you, could you calm down? Like... Okay, the project that I'm going to help out with this week is Dancing W from our Pleasant Hill location. It, the game is basically a maze game, but it's impossible. You're this bear, and you start off and you immediately lose. When you make your game, well, you're the creator, so you know how to beat it, but everybody else is just a beginner. So let's check out the start of the game. Let's look at the code and let's figure out which bat that is. There it is, that bat right there. So his go-to position is way too difficult. So let's go ahead and move him to a more practical position. How about right there? When you move a sprite in Scratch, it automatically updates the motion blocks over here. So we can just swap it out now with the correct go-to. Now the game will be much more playable. There we go. Now, it's like impossible to lose now because both of those bats are stuck. So it does need some adjustment. Anyways, dancing, awesome start. Oh.